Hello everyone, it's me Chebby from Unique Tutorials. Today, in this video, I will show you how to fix the action can't be completed because the file is open in any Windows computer. So, without for more delay, let's begin. So, firstly, let me show you. Say, if I try to delete one file, say, let me try to delete it. So, you can see here, you are getting one message here. As you can see, the action can't be completed because the file is open in respective application name. So, kindly note that the name of the application will be shown here. So, in my case, you can see here, the application name, this. At the bottom also, you can see the application details, everything here, right? So, if I click on try again also, still, it will unable to perform the action. So, you might be thinking what causes this issue that means it's a very straightforward meaning that means that the file is already being open so for this the first method what you can do is on your windows taskbar you can see your tray icon just click on it now you need to find out if the application is present here or not so in my case you can see here the capen is running already in the background that means it's showing up in my taskbar tray menu so if you don't see here also then you can try the second method so for the second method what you can do is on your computer keyboard just press ctrl shift escape to open the task manager and just select this process step and after that just find out here if you don't see just scroll down and you can search for the application name so in my case it's a uh, caffeine so you can see here it's running in the background so just select it and click on this end task now it has been disabled now let us open the folder again and now let me try to delete this file so you can see i can delete this file now so by using this method you can easily fix the action can't be completed because the file is open in any windows computer very easily so if you never known about the school tricks then you should definitely give it a try so if you find this video tutorial useful just click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to your channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching 